I started dancing when I was three years old. Well, I've been dancing since I was about seven years old. And since I was three, turning four. Started when I was six. Since I was four. Started dancing when I was seven. Um, started when I was four. So that's 14, 15 years. <laughs> this is my 13th year. 14 years or so. It'll be about 15 years next year. 16 years now. 22. Started off with just like ballet and like creative movement, so basically pointing my toe and then, you know, I got into jazz and then tap and yeah, and then now I do the lots. I did jazz. Yeah, and I remember sitting on the stairs while my mum was late and I was watching like the ballet girls on the tap and I went, oh, I have to try that out. So yeah, the next year after that is when I started doing everything. When I started, you were just in a grade and you had your three pairs of shoes and we just changed in that lesson. So then from that, I've just done it all. Dancing is sort of a really good way to express yourself like emotionally and mentally in a physical way. And it sort of just runs out of you and it's fun and it's sort of like a release. And all the girls here are like my family and I couldn't not see them three times a week or I'd go insane. Just, you know, with the stresses of high school, it was always like good having something else that I could focus on and just like another community of like girls who I love. I love them. <laughs> when um, I started uni, I had to quit for half a year, for a semester of uni. And I don't think I've ever cried so much in my life as when I had to stop dancing because it clashed with everything at uni and it was horrible six months. <laughs> and so yeah, I appreciated it more when I came back after that, I think. I love tap. Yeah? Yeah, because you get to make lots of noise, that's fun. And I love contemporary because it's all about expressing yourself. Mm. It depends on my, the weather, on the day of the week, on what mood I'm in, what my favourite style is. But I really enjoy probably contemporary and tap the most because contemporary is like the release thing that I like, but tap is just, just fun. <laughs> I like them all, as long as I can smile. I <laughs> love being on stage and I love pretending to be someone else, like you can just change who you are and it's sort of fun to change who you are. I love being on stage and being a different person for a little while under the lights and the costume. The emotion that you bring out when you dance is just completely different to everyday life. Mm. It just feels amazing. I just love that split second where you hit a you hit a move or something like that and you just you feel you feel beautiful. I started assistant teaching with Miss Suzanne when I was 13. I did that until I finished school and then when I turned 18, Miss Shalina asked me if I'd like to start teaching at the school. Um, I really enjoyed it um, and I think even more now when, like on Sunday watching the theatre rehearsal and you see the kids that I taught in creative movement are now in like grade two tap. It was hard sometimes, really hard. Saturday mornings when I had all the little kids in a row and finished off the day with creative movement. Sometimes I just could not wait for it to be over, but it's so rewarding and the kids love it and they have such a good time and it's so nice to be able to give that to people. You can get really attached to something that you really, really love. That's why I can't imagine life without it because it's just it's given me so much. I don't think that my life would exist without it. <laughs> don't waste. So you see some kids that just are amazing potential and they don't love it so they don't try. But some kids you can just tell like they come to class every week, they're always smiling, they just love to dance and that's what I want them to have, just to love it as much as I do. Try hardest and work hard and <laughs> have fun, definitely have fun and if you don't love it anymore, don't do it because you just end up hating it and it would be horrible to hate dancing. Thank you.
Thank you.